Hey guys, you're with Craig. Today is day four of the 30 day challenge and if you are new to the channel, you've got about four hours, five hours, um, to enter the competition to win a SaaS product today for $49. You just need to comment on any video on the channel and you'll need to subscribe otherwise you won't get, get the notification. So hit the notification bell, right? Let's just dive in. Today I want to do a review on this product right as in and the reason I want to sort of push it out a little bit earlier than is that these guys made an announcement today that they are going to stop doing the lifetime uh, deal. That just came out about 20 minutes ago. So if you're on the fence or whatever about buying this tool, um, I suggest you get it and I'm going to show you why you should get it. Now there is a link below, it's an affiliate link. If you buy through my link, I will give you some uh, help in getting set up if you need it. But uh, if you don't buy through the link, it doesn't matter. Okay, so let's just get stuck in. So if you've seen anything about this tool, uh, you'll know there's three parts to it. There's actually four parts because over here they have a plagiarism checker, which is you know world class. But the bits that we're using here: uh, topic discovery, content creator, and keyword explorer. Now I had a uh, a friend ring up today actually who uh, has a skin or has a very small you know like a market type skincare business, organic skincare, very small. But they want to go online and get things cranked up. So they asked me what I should do, and I said, well, yeah, here's what I would do. And I, we did a zoom and I showed them. Um, they have bought this tool, by the way, so they were impressed as well. Okay, so let's just go into uh, topic discovery. And I'm going to enter the word organic skincare. And I've chosen New Zealand. Now, <clears throat> New Zealand's a very small population, so you know there's not a bulk of traffic for all of these terms. Uh, but you can be doing this, of course, uh, globally. So the topic discovery, what it does, it goes and gets the entities that are associated with your main keyword, and you can search by uh, sort by search volume. So there's men's skincare, um, Korean organic skincare store, organic skincare formulations. Uh, so what this does, it just gives you a bit of a, oh, there's royal jelly, that's an interesting one. It just gives you a bit of an overview. There's cruelty free, okay, so that's obviously you can uh, link to it, face moisturizer. And any of these things here, you can go and get uh, ideas. You can get the questions, prepositions, comparisons. So all the stuff that you need for writing content. Plus you can get some headlines and you can add these to a list. So if I want to add that to a list, I've already created a list here to show you. Uh, so this one is a headline. So I just go headline, add. And then this one here, I can go, yep, I want that one too. I'm going to put that as a question. And then later on, as you'll see, we'll find some keywords that they can actually use to write content that has low uh, traffic, uh, low um, competition. Sorry. Okay, that's so that's I'm going to do this really quick because uh, otherwise the video will take too long. But that is topic discovery, hugely valuable. Lots of information in there that will help you get content. So that's topic discovery. The next one we will do is keyword explorer. So we'll jump over to that. Now, when you um, set this up you will have a couple of choices and when we, in fact I'll just do one to show you because this is sort of quite important. Where is it? Here it is. So if I go to Keyword Explorer and set one up, you see here you've got check all in title and clustering of keywords. And when you put your topic in there, if you put these in you use up more credits. The credits are extremely generous. In fact the video the owner just put out today, he was comparing to other monthly fee platforms and these guys are about 80% ahead of the credits of what they're offering on this free deal. So it's it's incredible, yeah. But then, so if you do those, you'll use some of your credits. If you don't do it, then you won't use the credits. But this is one without the credits. So I've searched for best moist, moisturizer for dry skin. And all I'm interested in here is just get some other keywords and get some volume on it. And then the one beside it, I have used all in title. And this is a more broader term like dry skin creams, okay? So what we can do in here, is that we can actually use this filter and search for low competition keywords. So this one here is 292,000 web pages with it in, cream foot. And if we go this way, then we can see there's no one has got this term, you know, no one's optimized for that term at all. So dry skin on face best creams, it's got 20 a month. Uh, there's not, you know, you could do something around that. Best moisturizer for dry skin, hand cream for rough palms. All these things are very low volume. That's because we're in New Zealand. If you're overseas or going globally, then you'd get you know, much bigger volumes. I've got one niche that I'm in, or niche, niche, whatever you pronounce it. Uh, these things were zero, and then I've got three or four thousand volumes. So yeah, you can find things really, really well. 
And okay, so that's the idea there. Once again, with this one here, so this hand cream, well, it's not relevant to them. Um, but let's just say this one here, I can add this to a list and I go add to, add keyword to a list and I want to do keywords, low competition, add. So this is how you build up your research as you're going along. The other thing here is this is their algorithm at uh, writers in how they calculate the competition. So if we go back to the, this one's a hundred out of a hundred. So, you, you know, it's very hard to rank for and obviously zero is not. And this is pay, pay per click. Uh, word count, how many words, cost per click. Right, let, so that one is a quick overview. There are there are other things you can do uh, in keyword. You can also go to keyword, you can actually search by domain. So you can get your competitor's domain and see what keywords they're ranking for. Right, moving on to the next one, uh, which is going to be the content writer. So uh, just give me a sec, I'll get set up. Okay, so what this part of the tool is, and this is the one I guess is the most valuable, uh, you, when you go back into here, you can see all the competing websites and how much content they've got on their pages. So what their articles, or these aren't articles, these are just product pages, but you get an idea and it gives you an, an estimate here on how long your article needs to be, to be, you know, longer than, uh, bigger than your competitors and how many paragraphs you need, how many images and so on and so forth. And then we will obviously put a title and stuff in there, which I haven't done, but that shows you the keywords to include. And you can go through and add more if you want to, um, based on, you know, you can see how many times they're used and such like. But when you set this up, it will suck the keywords in that they're recommending and give you uh, the amount of times that they think you should be using it based on how big your article is. Okay. So this is really powerful. Now, I've done some articles in the last couple of weeks using this tool that are ranking on the front page of Google. So this stuff really, really works. And I've got one article I wrote, which is now ranking for 54 keywords, four of which are on the front page. And this is for a uh, one of my customers. So yeah, it's really, really good. Uh, you'll notice these guys, they're pretty, uh, what's the word, um, moderate, conservative with what they're saying. And that's, that's a great approach on some of the keywords. So if you jam an organic skincare 23 times, it just isn't going to read right. It's going to be you know, pretty crappy, but you know, they're saying eight out of eight, you should be good to go. You can see the competitors, how they're using the terms. Uh, you, can, you can see the questions relating to the topic. And you can get Reddit as well, but you know, just off Google, people also ask. So you can see that people also ask questions, give you some ideas, and uh, might be some headlines for you and so on and so forth. So, and as you go through and add the keywords, so the skincare products, if I chuck that one in, you can see at the moment, we've got it twice in there. And if I belt in there and go one, two, and okay, go now four out of seven, three, four, so we're six out of seven, we've gone green. We've gone green there. Okay, so that's they're saying that's enough. You don't need to go too crazy with it. And they are putting a lot of emphasis on this keyword, even though it's only got three total uses, because they uh, obviously, they uh, see value on it. Now, the other thing I should mention is, the other products I've been using, which use natural language processing, uh, that is a paid um, system. So you only I got five credits a month and I had to pay for more. This one is totally built in to the algorithm. And I guess that's where they get things like this from. So that is really it. Plus there's a plagiarism tool over here, which is rated the best in the world. You get 40,000. So this deals on uh, AppSumo. It's, it's finishing soon. You know, I recommend you grab it. I Some of the best tools I use now, I started off uh, working like this. So I use Convertry uh, Landing Page Builder. That's now, you know, 100 bucks a month, whatever it is. I started off the same as this. That was four years ago. I use it every day. Paper Form was the same. It came in as a startup like these guys. And because you are part of the project going forward, you are, you know, helping them build the product you end up with these, you know, with a really super product and you get all the updates for life. And paper form, if you haven't checked that one out, there's a link in the description. That is next level form builder, man. I tell you, it is next level. Okay, and they started off exactly like this. They had, you know, there was just a husband and wife team. I think they've got about 30 staff now. So, yeah, cool. Guys, I'm going to do the draw later on tonight. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Hey, I really appreciate you. I hope this review was helpful for you. And this is my second attempt at uploading this thing. The first one, it got 
uh, something went wrong with it and the uh, it lost half the video so here we go again okay have an awesome weekend it's friday here in new zealand it's probably thursday where you are but have a great friday have a great weekend just have fun bye